hi guys what's up welcome and welcome back to jinx verse it's your girl only come back in another video and today as you can tell from the title i'm going to be doing my curling hair routine in with three simple ingredients that are very affordable that you can get in any supermarket and fast it's not exactly five minutes but you could get it done in the morning before you have an appointment or an outing or anything you want to do it's for short natural hair because that's why i tried it on i don't know if it works for relaxed hair i don't know how well it will work for long hair or longer hair anyways but it should work for short fussy hair on my previous video my aliexpress video i said i forget that video to 40 likes that i would do the curling hair routine and that's why i'm back again with this video because you guys didn't <laughs> so anyways this is what it looks like now but i'm going to be showing you how to make this go to this so we're going to be yeah needing just three simple things we have echo styler gel when i first wanted to try this because i had many fails before i eventually got it right when I first wanted to try this, the video I watched, because I watched a couple videos before I could finally bring them up together. They used the greenish looking one, so I thought, oh, maybe I bought the wrong gel and it won't work, but that, it's not really important. As far as it's Echo Styler, because it's, you know, tested and proved. So there's that, you need gel, and you need an amount of it, so make sure this tub might not be enough if you want to do it like a regular thing and keep it up you might need the bigger one also we have the living conditioner how do you do this yeah living conditioner i use cancer's living conditioner but you can use any that works for you it will be best to use it by mixing it up with water in a spray bottle and applying it to your hair i'll explain the process in a second and last but not least we have the curling cream this is cantu's jesus i am a cantu ambassador okay so we have the cantu curling cream you just need a little bit of it because it leaves flakes as you can see i haven't washed my hair yet so that's why it looks like this but just take a li I will show you in the video. <laughs> it's fine. So these are three things that you need for this video. One thing I mixed up was that when I was making my curls the first time, I used the foam thingy to try and get it really curly. You're not supposed to do that. That would just only dread your hair or twist it up like really knotty. Not K N O T. Knotty. And then it looks more like dreads or dada or full locks rather than twist and i also saw that you could actually like twist the hair as you're applying the, the things that you're applying but that takes an amount of time that we do not have and it also doesn't give the best results so this is what i did and this is what i'm going to be showing you how to do to get your curls the way i got them that time free curls just all over the place really cute curls a faster method to get curls in your natural 4c hair and i hope you enjoyed this video guys i'm going to go wash my hair now and then i'll start the video the video is going to be mostly probably a voiceover with a lot of music in the back because there's not much talking to do but if there is need to talk i will talk and explain to you the details that you need to do and follow it's a very simple method and it's not that deep so yeah i'm gonna go wash my hair you're not gonna follow me because I ain't trying to turn my vampires into onion. Okay. I'm back. I just washed my hair. It's still a bit damp as you can probably see. And I'm just going to show you how to begin. So we're going to start with applying the leave-in conditioner. Now I told you that you have to mix it up in water first. It's better to use it like that. I've already mixed some of mine up, but I'm going to show you how to mix it properly and how you can use it to comb out your hair because curls work better when your hair is like, you know, free of knots and tangles and all that. Okay. And then you make sure it enters like that. So you do that to your whole head. My hair is not that long. So I feel like this would be enough. But essentially, if you add water up to here, you should add this much living conditioner. Mm -hmm. 
you have to apply it into your hair like that nice and comb it out Now that I've combed my hair out and it just passes through all fluffy like yeah you can see some leave-in conditioner residue but that doesn't matter but I'm going to go to the next stage this is an unscripted stage because it's not necessary I do it but it's not important you don't have to but I do it because my hair my scalp gets dry a lot so it needs a lot of like oils and things to keep it moisturized so I'm going to be applying my coconut oil my castor oil and my Jojo battery oil it's not compulsory this is a three-step routine you do not have to use it but if you have it and you want to use or you have your own essential oils that you want to use you can add it but this is when you add it by the way should i do a trying asmr video because i always drop hints but i don't think anyone catches it or is it not for my audience you guys should let me know in the comments please make sure you get the scalp oils are for your head your scalp not for your hair in particular <sighs> After applying all the oils, your hair is scattered again, so you're probably wondering why do we have to comb it? I don't know myself, but I always do. Well, going next to the curling cream. Like I said, you don't want a lot because it makes your hair really, it dirties the hair like a lot because it will leave flakes and it looks like you have dandruff or something, but you don't. I was really scared. I thought I had dandruff, but it was just the flakes from the, because it's coconut curling cream. You get a generous amount, but not a lot. Yeah. Then you apply it. Make sure it gets everywhere. Yes, your hair is white, but it will set. So don't worry about it. I was scared about that too. Because it took a while to set. But it sets eventually. Like if you have a program for 10, you have to wake up like 8 o'clock. Do all the stuff that you need to do. Have your bath, cook, eat, whatever, whatever. 9 o'clock style your hair do it do it do it do it do. but before you get maybe you leave your house 9 30 depending on where you're going to before you get to where you're going it's ready in fact before that 9 30 itself if you start at 9 o'clock and you do all this in like five minutes by that 9 30 everything sets now the most important part you robo robo your head like this you robo robo it's like this you don't need a foam or a brush you just need your hands and your fingers Robo, 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 robo. As you can already see, some curls are coming out. Can you see? It's not properly defined yet, but there's already curls. So you robo, 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 robo for a while. And before it dries, finish, you take your styling gel. A generous. generous amount and you apply it to your hair i apply it in clumps like this so that i won't put too much in one place i won't put too much at once anyways apply it apply it, apply 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 it apply it in fact if you're going out just budget 30 minutes for your hair like from start to finish okay now you've applied it do it again yes it looks white i know right the echo styler gel makes the all the products that you put really come out so now we just do the thing with our hand all over again for as long as you have but i like to do this for like five to ten minutes i know my hand hurts but the results are great So 
while this sets so while this sets and the white goes away i'm going to clean out the excesses on my face and i'm going to eat because my sister made mad fried rice so i'll come back in a bit i will time it so you know exactly how long it takes So guys it's been like 15 minutes most of the white is gone but there's still a lot of like clumps and i'm just waiting for it to be done but you can see them girls yeah 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 it's completely cleared out and the curls are really defined now as you can tell it's really you know curly and nice if you want you can make a pattern you could style it however you want you could just add some edges you can i like to take it like this i don't need any more as far as i've got the curls so if you like this um tutorial and you want to try it again on your own you might want to do it the day before or the night before then wear a bonnet or a durag or something to bed and then when you wake up in the morning just spray some leave-in conditioner rough it up a bit then wait for it to dry that would be much faster and that's the way to you know the upkeep of it if you want to keep keeping in the curls just every morning when you wake up it's be kind of hard because there's gel in it then you spray with some leave-in conditioner and water rub your hand in it a little bit and wait for it to dry if you use a dryer it's much faster or you can wait for it to dry on its own like i do but using a dryer is much faster you could do that or you could take the risk wake up really early or at least two hours earlier and then try the routine hopefully it won't become a mess for you but this was a success i'm happy with the results this is the curly hair routine and my second part to my short natural hairstyle i hope you enjoyed this and please try this out and tag me on instagram twitter facebook wherever oh it twitter is banned but anyway just let me know that you guys are doing this and following up with me i really appreciate your support and i can't wait to hear back from you please leave a like a comment tell me if you're going to try it how i look you can just tell me your favorite color i don't really care just leave a comment about something and share this video to someone else i'm really tired because i was watching the movie and almost falling asleep and i realized oh wait i haven't done the reveal yet so i really hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you next time don't know why it looks like i have a bald spot right over here but that's just the way <gasps> wait till... okay anyways that's just the way it looks thank you guys for watching please if you like this video leave a like if you want to comment tell me anything about your day tell me anything you like about this video tell me give me suggestions ask questions on what to do and i'll see you next wednesday bye i'm going to put like a comparison